Pokemon Scarlet and Violet are only about 130 days away and we still don't know all of it. There have been lots of leaks already, but most of them are shady, bad quality or massive YouTubers have already talked about them. But there's one topic I haven't seen much. Where are the two legendary Pokemon located? I'll be basing this theory on what we saw with Sword and Shield with the trailers. Just like in Sword and Shield trailers, we were shown what the legendary Pokemon are in a cinematic scene. In Sword and Shield, we were shown Zacian and Zamazenta in a forest, and we know this Pokemon was in a base game map. Officially, we have only partial maps of both in-game and real life, but if they were combined, we would have most of the Iberian Peninsula. And since the Balearic Islands are visible and the cinematic showed an island, it's an educated guess that Miraidon and Coridon are located in one of them. And since we're talking about the map, we can make predictions on DLC locations. We got DLCs in Sword and Shield, Isle of Armor based on the Isle of Man, and Crown Tundra on the rest of Scotland. So it's not far-fetched. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. How, how could I not say that? Since the new region map includes both Spain and Portugal, we can look at their overseas territories. Portugal's Madeira Islands and Azores, plus Spain's Canary Islands and settlements of Zuta and Melilla in the Moroccan coast. The islands can have the same treatment as the Isle of Armor. By the way, fun fact, the largest island in the Azores, São Miguel Island, is the only place in Europe where pineapples are grown, even though in greenhouses. So the islands can be tropical and reached in a similar way as the Isle of Armor. Plus the two Spanish settlements can introduce some limited edition of Pokemon like desert Pokemon. So what do you think? Are these theories possible and how likely? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And don't forget to hit the like, subscribe and share to help my channel grow. I'ma see you guys later. Bye.